tonight I'm using my One Tigress lightweight cot. Now I've used this twice before and I had trouble putting it up so I've now learned how to do that properly. I've seen quite a lot of bad reviews for it and it's because the instructions aren't overly clear. And we just slot both these poles in. They go in towards the end with the logo on it. And now we have four of these feet parts. These were the bits that people are finding difficult, I think. because the instructions make it look like they go in that way when really they don't, you need to do it the other way. See that's the wrong way to put the foot in because then it ends up sagging in the middle. So the correct way to do it is with it arching inwards. But then if you try and force it into the poles you're not going to be able to do it, it's not going to give. But this little part here, if you push them both in, it folds out. That then allows you to connect up both poles and then push it into place. And you get a nice rigid flat surface doing that. And there we go, a nice rigid camping cot. The first time I tried to put it up, I was in the dark and I didn't realize that those little buttons push in. So I ended up sagging in the middle. I was, it was usable, but it wasn't as comfortable as it could be. I nearly sent it back actually. So now I know how to do it. I'm looking forward to using it properly for the first time. And I'll give you a review in the morning of how well I slept. <laughs> just had to take it apart and build it again inside the tent so if you are building it build it in the tent because you can't get it in well I can't get it in this one it's a, an iron wall I'm using morning so I've had my first night in the one tigress lightweight cot it felt like you were sleeping on the ground but you're higher up um, it's the right width it's the right length it was just really really comfortable now to take it apart, it's just the same as putting it up whereby you grab these little round things and push them in. They're a bit tricky to push in. Because there's quite a lot of tension on them. 
but then once you do it just pops off they're quite violent and jerky taking them off but yeah it's just those little black circles you push them in and it makes the whole thing far easier so overall yeah i'm delighted with it it's a good bit of kit it's um yeah i would say it's worth the money actually all right well i'll get packed up and be on my way all right thanks for watching i'll catch you next time Thank you.